Hello? Is your husband there? This is just a friend. No need to start getting all crazy. Oh, stop acting like I call you like 2 or 3 in the morning. Is he there? He's going to work. Well, did you make sure he was well-dressed, looking presentable with matching socks, making sure his drawers didn't have no holes? You know, did you just make sure he looked presentable to go on the job? That concerns me because, oh my goodness, you need to be grateful that another woman also care about your husband and want to make sure he's well taken care of. I am that woman who calls every home and makes sure y'all the women, y'all taking care of y'all men and doing what you're supposed to do so he's not out here chasing other women. Now, look, did you even feed him before he could go to work? Because it sounds like he's going to go do a 12-hour shift. Did you feed him? That is none of my concern. Okay, you know what? I'll just take some meal over there, show up at his job, and make sure he did eat. And if not, he can he can eat and have some left over for, for, for this overnight shift. How could you let your husband go to work and not take care of his needs, his basic needs, before he could go to work? Did you even give him the cookie? I'm going way too far. See, you starting to really worry me. Worry me to the point where I'm going to have to call a dispatcher to come out there to do a well check of occasionally on your husband. You don't sound like you're very mentally stable. I'm not insulting you. I asked you a simple question to make sure you're taking care of your husband. And you're flying off the handle. It is my job. I'm just a concerned citizen. Look, you're not going to have any kids against me. I'm just a concerned citizen, concerned about your husband's well-being.